the last couple ones were like really, really good. This one's gonna be a little bit. Hola muchachos, good morning, happy Monday, it's Monday. Uh, I'm 37 weeks, which I am so thankful for. That means we're full term. So quick update, through pretty much most of the night, I've been on and off laboring in a lot of pain. How dilated am I at this point? Like 500. <laughs> Ready for this. We, yeah, our baby should be floating up by this point. Ah. Hey, got made. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm about 500 centimeters dilated at this point. Uh, I told Kieran, I said, Kieran, just, I said, I said, I'm just gonna play with people, so like, throw me a number. Over Five. six. <laughs> 500. 500. 500. No, I, I have not been laboring. I have been totally fine. Yesterday my tummy was super duper tight, but it wasn't full on contractions. Anyway, this vlog yeah. is the possible vlog before I give birth. I have no idea. God knows, and I don't. If you didn't know, I have had two kids in that 37 week period. So for us, this is a little bit of go time. And then on top of all of that, we're getting our bathroom run out. Should we take these things down or no? Just leave them. This is Sarah, lost in her own bathroom. Well, I'm. No, <laughs> I'm just thinking of. Um, oh, we'll take down their, their toothbrushing chart. Ch ch Church. Mm -hmm. It's a toothbrushing cart. It's as you get in and you drive and it brushes your teeth. <laughs> yeah, the toothbrush is attached to the That's axle. like so Dr. 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 Seuss. It's gonna be a little bit echoey because we're in an empty bathroom, but when we moved, oh, no. when we moved here, we wanted to tackle the kitchen first, like our, our big project, and then move on to other things such as the bathroom. This is where Ward, hold on, Karen's ripping tape off the door. I don't know. <laughs> okay. See ya. <laughs> Bye. Wouldn't wanna be ya. <laughs> no. Nope, not at this point of pregnancy even it. This is the Lord willing where I'm going to give birth. I had a water birth at home with my previous, like my last labor, Elizabeth, and I loved being in the bath. I loved being in the water. The issue with this bathtub is that it is, I believe, 10 inches of soaking depth. It's like, it's like about this, <laughs> it's 10 inches, pull out a ruler, you'll figure it out. It like just covers my butt and then a little bit of my belly. I need more water to body ratio to get the full benefits of <laughs> having a really nice water birth. We did already replace the vanity and it looks great. The matte black is what we're going for with the white. But yes, this is our tub. It's very, very short. It's a short tub. So the tub we're getting is I think almost 16 inches of soaking depth. I think it's a little bit wider than this one. So it's gonna be so nice. But the thing is, is that I cannot, I cannot go into labor until like six, seven days from now because that's when all of this is going to be done. <laughs> so we're gonna see what happens. So new tub, getting rid of this. This is so annoying. We're gonna get new shower curtains, retiled, painted, new fan, light fixtures. <sighs> it's gonna be so good. And I'm just praying that I don't go into labor until it's done because this is a huge item that is really, really nice to have in a home birth, a beautiful deep bathtub. <laughs>
one's gonna be coming a little bit in and out. I made a couple loaves of sourdough. So one is for us and then one is for our contractor, Jordan. -da -da. <sighs> These are good. Okay, welcome back, day two. Um, let's go upstairs. Kids are playing with Play-Doh. I should probably do my hair, but I'm gonna take you guys upstairs. Bathroom situation, tub gone. You guys saw that yesterday. Tile gone. So today, Chris, our plumber, is going to put in the bathtub, hook up the, the drain and the water, and you know, this is me not knowing what I'm talking about. He's gonna do all that. It would be so cool to have the tub in here. Hopefully it fits through this really skinny doorway. And then tomorrow is tile. We are going to go pick out some new lighting. It's gonna be great, it's gonna be great. I need to fix this. <laughs> I've mildly put off showering just because tonight I need to shower and I need to shower with Elizabeth because we don't have a bathtub. I'm just gonna shower with her in our stand-up shower, so I shall wash my hair then. <laughs> okay, this is gonna have to work. We also, today in the mail, I'm an insane, you can see our camera, hey. I am insane about baby wearing, I love the baby wearing. I got this one by Baby Jorn, born Baby Bajorn. How do you say this, Sarah? Editing Sarah, help help us out. It's it's pink, and I feel like I, I don't know whether it's a boy or girl. Pink carrier? Who cares? Kieran wears pink. Guys can wear pink. Guys can totally wear pink, just like girls can totally wear blue. Anyway, I'm gonna have to figure out how this goes. <laughs> We are, <laughs> it's a little off, but we are, we are ready. So this is for newborn to something. It's the mini. I'm squatting because it's good for me and so you guys can properly see. I think I did this right. We're probably gonna have to do a few adjustments because <laughs> a newborn is much smaller than this. Oh, ooh. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for baby wearing. Uh, we're gonna go pick out a light. Nice dancing, Calvin. I like the shuffle. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, <laughs> oh, it's so deep. Thanks. Wow, it is so deep. Uh, that's gonna be perfect for laboring it's, materials. It's gonna be prime labor and it's gonna material. Be it's gonna be perfect for Papa because he's the biggest of our family, so that's gonna be perfect. Oh, yeah. That's gonna be perfect for laboring. I'm gonna squat in here, and I'm. Oh, Kieran, there's so much room. Yeah, you know, oh my man. word! Especially. We could all love <laughs> you like that? That and a seat. And to be... not have that annoying rail. Yeah. That could be enough. That could be enough. <laughs> of a problem. I don't even want to call it a problem because the Lord did answer my prayer. And my prayer was, it, well actually it wasn't, I want a fully renovated bathroom by the time I give birth, I want to have tile on the wall, I want it completely painted. My prayer was, Lord, let us have a functioning bathtub for me to labor in. Oh, that was my prayer. Just a second. Breathing is getting hard. And guess what, he answered my prayer. Yesterday, I legitimately had two baths. Our bathtub is in, like what you guys saw previously, and it would have been on its way to being tiled, or it would have had tile on it, maybe not grouted, but tile would be there if the tile wasn't defective. The tile that we ordered has a little bit of a curve to it. It is long subway tiles and it has a curve to it. I'll get one and I'll show you. I don't know if you'll be able to tell on camera, but if I hold it like this, there is a bend through the tile itself. <laughs> so our tile guy was putting on tile and then he realized this and I'm thankful that he did. So we ordered new tile, more tile that is hopefully not like this, but just completely flat. So tile, no go, but bathtub, it is working. Because the bathtub is working and because I've 
mentally entered into the idea of possibly giving birth this weekend. I want to clean the house, I want to tidy, I'm going to bring you guys along with me, we're just going to play some music, get things done, clean, tidy, are we nesting? Absolutely. Just in case baby makes an appearance, I want the house to be clean, so that's what I'm going to be doing. Baby may not come, baby might come. We did go on a nice long walk and that felt really good to get the kids out and riding bikes and even for me to just walk around it felt really nice, but let's go ahead and get some cleaning done. Hold on to the lights. Totally safe. I'll turn them on and off. I'm getting excited. 